and welcome back for another episode of Let's Play SimCity 4. As you can see, we are back in my city, Funktropolis. And I think it's about time to show you guys why I've uh, not been doing too much with this particular city now lately. Or SimCity 4 in general, I should say. Uh, at the moment, it looks okay. To many an eye, you'll probably see this as a nice, thriving city. Few more discerning members, or uh, watchers, sorry, might notice that there are a few things missing. Over here, for example, there's clearly residential that is not there. That's a little odd. And you may notice the same thing again on the right. And you may also have noticed a small change that there are now residents over here on the left. All of that is interconnected. You see, the reason why I haven't been doing many episodes lately is because this pissed me off a lot. And that is why the long commute time. Those of you who played SimCity 4 know what comes after long commute time. Shut up. Now you can see that these people are trying to work next door, which is why I've got them plastered against the side here. They have access to the freeway and subway to go next door, as I mentioned. But, lo and behold, I've got long commutes. And if I let this go, because you can see it's kind of frozen here. But if I let it go, or worse yet, if I put more residential in here, what we see is residential that are, uh, can't find a job. I get no job zones. And that's pissing me off, because they're trying to work over here, and no matter what I do, it seems to be too much. Now, you can see this huge demand for commercial services and office buildings. And in one of my attempts that I did not save, I actually flooded this area here with uh, commercial to see if I can get these little idiots to work there instead of over there. But no can do. Something over on the left is demanding high wealth jobs. And I don't really know what it is or how to fix that at the moment. I, it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, let's see, if these were to kindly develop, you'd see what I'm talking about. Unfortunately, they seem to be a little bit of an annoyance right now. Oh, here we go, we might see it. Oh, yeah, we already do. We already do. See right here. No jobs out, and that's gonna increase. Shame, too, there are so many buildings here that I just love. This guy, for example, he's so cool. This Emerald Park. Congratulations, Cobb. You made one very fine building. And yeah, you can see over here again, I've placed a uh, commercial. But even if I get him to build up, it really doesn't matter. I'll demonstrate that, I guess, right now, I suppose. Whatever. Um, just go ahead and extend this road arbitrarily. Actually, no. No, 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 no. If I put it over there, you'd be like, Well, of course, this guy over here doesn't have a job because he's got to go all the way over there and he's kind of pissed at that. Yada, yada, yada. No, 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 no. Let's go ahead and do something cool. We're going to go ahead and really show you what I'm talking about. And since this might take a second, I'm going to go ahead and pause my recording. Alright, you can see I went ahead and I put in quite a lot of uh, commercial, right? I've got uh, some residential. I've got frame issues. So now if I unpause this and they grow, then ideally there should be no job problems because they can literally cross the freaking street and get to their job. That's a pretty short commute. I can't do one any smaller than that. So here we go, with some development. These guys aren't doing so hot, so let's go ahead and bribe them like we are 
apt to do. We are not above rampant bribery. If that's what it takes to get your citizens to move on in there, then you go ahead and do that. You bribe those citizens. Okay, we're getting no job zots over here. And uh, the thing is with this, some people will go ahead and try to bulldoze the building and to have their unemployment go away, it doesn't work. It's like whack-a-mole. You hit it in one area, it'll come up somewhere else. And what's really frustrating about this is this was long commute a minute ago. Now it's short. And now these two are long commute and are about to be abandoned due to commute time. And in a minute, they'll probably go short too. Because the game is just the fighting me every step of the way. And yeah, same thing over here, you can see. Long commute times, long commute times. Essentially, the game doesn't like being unbalanced like this. It really, really, really hates it if you try and separate your cities in the fashion that I'm doing. I thought it was going to be okay, but it doesn't look like that's the case at all. I'm bribing my citizens. I'm just trying to get something growing in here to show you that it doesn't matter. I'm having a little bit of trouble with it. I think I lost all my... No, it's still there. Okay, whatever. Let's put in some uh, high-density... Uh... Industrial end, too. Why not? Let's give them some high-tech jobs to go to. Might as well. I don't know if they have water, but... No, they don't. Well, I don't care about efficiency right now, so let's do that. That seems to work. Got some people popping up. But these no jobs out there aren't going to disappear. They should. No matter how much commercial I uh, make in there. Yeah, again, whack-a-mole. Abandoned due to commute time. It didn't magically fix itself. You can see abandonment, abandoned, abandoned. And now we're on a deleting spree. That's why these areas were completely blank. Because I've already done this before. I put in commercial all the way up and down here. And it just didn't work. A lot of this is whack-a-mole, too. You can see that... Um, these office towers that housing 6,000 people, or not people, you moron, uh, 6,000 jobs, and same thing over here, they're being filled up and then they're being abandoned and going elsewhere and filling up and disappearing and yeah, same thing. It's because my job market sucks right now. Yeah, all of these guys while we weren't paying attention, same thing. Long commute time, long commute time, long commute time. I know where they're trying to go. I know exactly where they're trying to go, and I can't do anything about it. Um, do you have jobs yet? You, 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 are you long commute time? You're medium commute time. Well, medium isn't long now, is it? How about you? Where are you trying to go? You're getting on a bus, you're going over here, you're going over there, you're going across, and you're stopping there. That's kind of long commute time. It shouldn't be, because you can see clearly they have access to a fracking subway. But even this small distance should not be a long commute. Well, I guess that is kind of a large commute, isn't it? Eek! That is kind of huge. Holy Christ. And they're also going over... Okay, that's probably what it is. That's probably the long commute time. I've got some people who are fracking insane. Look at this. They're going over here and they're getting on something, a subway that makes a U-turn and goes down and around and over here. And once they're off here, it turns long. I don't think this right now is long. That's just medium. But the idiots are going over here, that's long. How's my retards over here doing? I'm getting abandonment here too. Because all of these guys, yeah, I can see. They're all going over there. And I thought by moving them here, I'd say I'd uh, fix it, but... Psh, no. I'll show you my other city. Alright, here we are in Abaddon. Uh, my city that's neighboring... Wow, frames. My city that's uh, neighboring... 
uh, Funktropolis. And as you can see, I got some development in here. That's nice, I guess. Medium well. It's a medium well city. It's what you'd expect. Medium and uh, low. It was a f it's a feeder city for Funktropolis. And as you can see, lining the edge is high tech, right? All that's high tech. Do we have a demand for high tech? A little bit, not too much. And it doesn't matter if I put it in either. Oh, high tech went away. Alright, so no demand for high tech. But that's where the high wealth residential would be working, ideally. They'd be working in the high tech. Because all the way over here is my, what are you? Yeah, my dirty and my manufacturing. Now, my high, my, uh, high wealth residential should not be working there. And I've meticulously gone through to make sure that there's no high tech jobs in here. And even if there were, it wouldn't cause that huge mass exodus trying to work here. That's just bringing my city to its knees over in Funktropolis. Only place I can see them working is in the uh, high tech area and our little uh, our little game cubes that we like so much. However, something about it is too far away. Something is too far. I don't have the demand for high tech. Well, I do. Comes and goes. I don't have much of a demand for uh, high tech, so it's not that they're trying to work somewhere else, somewhere farther than this. And that's a bit of a problem because I don't know where that could be. I mean, are they trying to work in the medium well commercial office buildings? I guess they could. Even that's not too far. It's a straight shoot too, just straight across and then there. But that is too. That could, probably could be a little bit too far away. Either way, it sucks. They're demanding my citizens to come here to work, and that's just killing them. They're just being destroyed by that. Uh, I had a city over here, I killed it, I blew it up, because I thought maybe something stupid was happening. I thought maybe they were coming here, and going into the city that's over here to try to work. So as you can see, I severed the connections, and then detonated the city to see if that would stop it. That didn't stop it at all. They just kind of laughed at that. High Wealth Commercial Services. I guess they could be working there. And I do have High Wealth Commercial Services here. Uh, not too many, but a few. A few. But they're pretty close to the edge, too. I mean, the High Wealth Commercial Services are primarily there. And the people who are working are right here. So, derp, 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 derp. That shouldn't be a problem, either. So, I'm 0 for 2, I guess. Um... Let me go back into my Funktropolis real quick. Yeah, as you can see, Abaddon was here, high tech, and I got the residential right here. They should just be hopping right on over. No problem, but problem, lo and behold, big problem. Large problem, huge problem. Kind of annoying. Annoying enough that I didn't feel like playing SimCity for a long time. And I went around playing other things. But what I think I might do... Is I might continue to pander to my commercial zones. Because I do have... Uh, demand for office and commercial services. I'm probably going to put the rest of that in here. After that, I have no idea. Because you might be thinking, well, why don't you just release your demand, your commercial, or not commercial, your residential uh, taxes on the other place. Let the high wealth there move in. And then just make the rest of the city commercial, which would eventually get rid of the no jobs that I'm complaining about here. Uh, yeah, try that one too. I placed uh, high wealth residential in Abaddon. And do you know what happened? They didn't have a job. They said the commute time was too long. So at that point, my head exploded. All over my monitor. At least that's what I was envisioning. 
because I officially could not figure out what was going on. If they're here, it's too far. If it's there, it's too far. And they were trying to work in there somewhere. So, uh, it's a pain. But while I'm doing this, I think what I'm going to do is move on to the next project that I had lined up. I think I'm going to make a city that isn't separated as I'm separating these cities. Because right now I'm separating them by wealth primarily. I think I'm going to go ahead and make a city that has everything in it. The low wealth, medium, high wealth, like a normal city, essentially. But I want your opinion on something. Should I use mods, or should I not use mods? And if I should use mods, which ones should I use? The network add-on mod, which gives me um, a lot more availability for roads and stuff. Should I use uh, cam again, which will give me you know, more buildings to choose from. Um, and should I use the road top mass transit mod? I think those are the only three that I'm going to have you vote on. So, CAM for larger buildings, uh, NAM, Network Add-on Mod for, you know, more road selection, and uh, whatever else I said, uh, Road Top Mass Transit. So let me know, and when I have enough or sufficient amount of votes in for that, I will go ahead and start that city. So until then, you now know what's going on in my city. Sorry if this is not turning out uh, better than, well, as good as I had hoped. It's kind of frustrating. When I was making this, perfect, fine, no problems. Then I began popping in more cities, and I began putting in more people, and then it began a problem. Because it's trying to... It's just trying to balance everything out. When it was just two cities, it was pretty easy to maintain a balance. Now, four cities, I've got people wanting to go everywhere, and it's just a pain in the ass. So yeah, let me know what you think. Send in your votes. And thank you for watching.